Greetings, my brothers and sisters. Uh, I am just so happy and delighted uh, to take a moment in this 40th anniversary celebration to remember and acknowledge Bridges. Uh, I often talk about remembering Bridges that brought us over that we're drinking water from wells that we did not dig or we're living in houses that we did not build or we're eating fruit from vineyards that we did not plant. And so I am a witness, I am a living testimony that there are many personalities uh, that help me along the way. I don't have a whole lot of time to name all of the ones, uh, but for the next few weeks, I want to take a moment to acknowledge a few special bridges. Uh, the first bridge I want to acknowledge today is family bridges, family bridges. It started a long time ago. Oh, I forgot. I'm not old. I just started early. So it started some time ago. Uh, but I honor uh, my parents. Uh, I am grateful for uh, the life of Bernice Terry Washington and James Jock Harrington. I am thankful for my mother and my father. Uh, my father uh, died early on uh, when I was just 16, uh, but I had 16 years uh, of fellowship and fun uh, with my father, who was more like an older brother. Uh, you see, I was raised in a house uh, with my great-grandmother, Fanny, and my grandmother, Ella. Oh, it was a wonderful house. You, you remember uh, growing up uh, with those mamas and grandmothers. Uh, Grandma Fanny uh, lived until I was about 12 years old. So those 12 years I had to experience her love. Uh, my mother, I call mother, uh, that was my grandmother, Ella. And uh, she lived and she was able to come and share uh, many times with Halifax and then Mount Peace. Oh, I am grateful for a wonderful, wonderful family. I, I am thankful for a mother who loved her firstborn and even uh, loved him enough to let his grandmother raise him. I am grateful. In that house, in that house, we had some of everybody there. Uh, we had uh, my great uncle Santee, my great uncle Paul. In that house, uh, we had some cousins like Eric and Corrine. In that house, we had my aunt, uh, you know, Magdalene, Magdalene. We had a wonderful house. Now that was 1105, 1101. We had uh, my aunt Patricia and, and even Aunt Ann. Uh, we had Aunt Lizzie, my great aunt Lizzie Green. We are grateful. And those persons helped me so much. Even, even my late aunt uh, Leon, as we would call her. They helped me so much. Early on in ministry, I did not have my own automobiles, and, but I never missed an engagement because of the lack of transportation. Uh, from uh, Leon driving me to services, uh, to uh, my Aunt Pat uh, furnishing cars, and Ann furnishing cars, Cadillacs, and Lincolns. Can you imagine this little fella driving all of those long cars? And then my great aunt Lizzie providing my first two cars. She bought cars for me when she didn't even have license herself. Man, we are blessed. I am blessed. And again, I thank God for family. Thank you, family. Oh, I didn't talk about uh, my closest sister because we were raised together in the same house. Monica, even today, is my strongest supporter. Thank you, family. I couldn't do without you. God bless you.